What's going on, Show Nation? It's Movie with Movie Gaming TV, and in today's video, I got a huge pack opening for you guys. We're going to open up five future star packs. We're going to open up one prospects pack. We're going to open up a 10 pack bundle that I got from completing Conquest going after Joe Maurer. We got five program packs, and we got a single pack to open up today. And I'm going to talk to you guys about the future stars. I'm going to talk to you guys about uh, pretty much the Joe Maurer grind. I also got Ryan Sandberg. And um, I also got Brooks Robinson. I don't quite have Maurer yet, but I'm going to have him soon, which is going to make for some lineup changes. So let's go ahead and open up this first pack here and see what we get. Hopefully the server goes pretty fast today. A lot of people I've noticed have been selling uh, minor league savings that you need for the Bryce Harper um, mission so that's kind of been slowing up the stadiums if you want to go and see how like it's crazy how the minor league stadiums have been selling uh they've been going uh pretty uh insane lately uh let's open up these five program packs <laughs> be crazy if we pulled like mike trout or some of the huge one of these program packs because they are uh, no sell i believe um we got four more to pull maybe we'll get somebody really cool uh, so the future stars packs, there's a one card I have to show you guys that makes it worth doing uh, everything for if you are interested in doing it. Um, and that is the Alex Reyes card of the card. That card looks super beast. Um, I'm glad because I went and did everything for it that there actually is something a little bit better than the Makeda card. So, I'm definitely looking forward to doing that. And then uh, for completing Conquest, I got another uh, bundle basically for doing that for the Joe Bauer. Um, it wasn't too bad of a grind. I was able to complete Conquest in like, um, I was able to complete it in 47, 48 turns or something like that. I think you can do it in 40 if you did it like perfectly. Uh, but I was able to do it in like 47, 48. So it wasn't that much of, of a difference. I did play the two a lot on All-Star and uh, a couple times on Hall of Fame, then a couple times on Rookie and stuff like that, too. Um, if your team's really beast, like, it's really not that hard to beat the computer a lot of the time in All-Star, or in All-Star. I think you can do a little bit faster if you do that. But, uh, be sure to check out my Cardinal Bird video on that if you're having trouble with Conquest. Uh, and just follow, watch it a couple times, follow his instructions. I think that's, like, the best way to do it. Outside of like, me doing a whole tutorial on it uh, at this point in the game. So far, uh, nothing too spectacular. We did a set one pack two, which is crazy. Uh, the very first set of the game. Probably going to get like uh, some free agents and stuff like that. I, I imagine it's still out of work. Who knows how like that even works now. Nothing so far. We got a gold uh, foot thing. Uh, I guess it's kind of interesting. Uh, these catchers, man, like all your catchers, uh, as well as your minor league stadiums and your catchers, make sure you're keeping an eye on them. Uh, the catchers are selling for like, you know, 200 subs uh, because people need them for the Joe Maurer mission uh, to collect. So be on the lookout for catchers. Uh, Joe Maurer is uh, another one. That uh, is going. Hey, no more Mazzara flashback. That's kind of interesting. And this uh, gold foot thing. That's kind of cool. Um, yeah. So be sure to sell uh, catchers. Be sure to sell those minor league stadiums if you don't want to. If you have extra ones and aren't planning on doing that, you can pick up some stubs there. Two more of these. I've been going through and selling a lot of cards like individually while I'm grinding. I'm always having like 20 cards in the, uh, in the market that I can sell. Um, it's uh, let me get like a, a good amount of stubs. But now we have uh, 10 live series players who are prospects or former number one prospects needed for the new Bryce Harper prospects program. This uh, costs like 1,500, I want to say, per pack. <clears throat> And uh, to see like what was inside one: Lou Weaver, Devers, Buxton, Reyes, Hoffman, which is good because he has one of the missions. Another Hoffman, and uh, all these kind of can be resellable in a way. Like you're not going to need a huge pull 
but the hopping was nice because he has missions and like uh, they can be there's one uh, mission where you have to collect uh, cards like this and so all of them will have some value so you're not gonna make like a ton of profit but like I did buy like Jeff Hoffman out of the uh, market and stuff like that and I had to buy some other cards like this out of the market so maybe one of them honestly wouldn't be uh, that bad of a deal now these packs contain future stars Ahmed Ro uh, Rosario and Tyler Glass now they're also um, 10,000 a piece and you can buy, buy up to five of them so this is like 50,000 subs worth of these packs but let's see how these future stars packs go uh, hopefully hopefully uh, they are lit man like uh, we'll have to see how it goes but uh, here we go let's go ahead and open the pack future stars. we got a gold who's one of the future stars we got a Blake Snell up at an 87 I'm not sure how much he goes for be really lit to get one of the diamonds <laughs> that would be awesome but um, as we wait for some lag the, the servers have been a little bit laggy because there's a lot of transition uh, transactions going on we got another gold who's the gold gonna be Orlando Arcia okay cool cool three more to go Francis Martez so we have two more Hunter Renfro I know he has a lot of power versus right that'd be an interesting BR card Gold. Another Orlando Arcia. So we're definitely selling one of the Orlando Arcias. And uh, let me show you guys. Uh, so I did complete uh, the missions for the Harper program. Um, and uh, some of these live series prospects, uh, you need number one prospects. And then you need these live series prospects. That's what that one pack's good for is for this. These are the minor league stadiums that I'm telling you have been going crazy. Then uh, all these missions are very easy to do, uh, especially like Mauer, just like two hits, uh, two runs with Profar is really easy. Uh, six innings with uh, Tyler Glass is really easy. Just, uh, you know, especially if you sub them into the game. And then uh, Jeff Hoffman, this one was easy too. You just need nine strikeouts, either sub them in or roll them. One of the two and then once you do that you unlock the Moncada um, program all you have to do is collect uh, Bryce Harper's card uh, so you need future stars hitting uh, that's actually quite a bit of stats with the future stars it's really like a lot of plate appearances so it is like quite a serious grind honestly uh, future starts pitching uh, that's a lot of strikeouts um, the wins not very much the innings pitch not very much uh, Two are uh, the mystery missions 50% and 75% and then the Hall of Fame game would probably be the easiest part and then uh, Collecting 10 future stars is why those packs were kind of nice pulled this out of the ticket counter uh, Let's see what this Orlando RC is going for because it definitely didn't have two of them Going for a pretty decent price Um was that like, like I'll put it like 249 so it's like one stub under um, so get some stubs back there but uh, this is really the card I wanted to show you guys this is 75% complete of the uh, the program here and this is the card I think is the best that I've seen out of all of them so far 82 89 99 velocity and 93 break and he has every pitch that you would want 14 12 curve change up sinker and slider which are all the best pitchers in combination outside of having a knuckleball so i definitely think that uh alex race and it's really you get it for 75 percent so if you can do 75 percent of the uh, moncada program you will get him unlocked which is uh really cool um i like that's a good pitcher that you could put on an elite team it's just going to take some work to get there so i definitely need to collect some of these other cards uh, to uh, get the 10 done 
and like get some for the hitting and the pitching but like damn dude like you'd really want to have like a full lineup because this is this is a serious grind to get there um i'd like to get there to get the reyes i might do it down the line as you guys can see i just need a couple more hits and rbis to get uh joe mauer and i'm looking forward to getting him and i'm thinking about uh, moving my uh, cat to shortstop, and uh, then I'm going to play Seager at second base. I picked up Sandberg. I picked up uh, Brooks Robinson. Uh, let me see if there's anything else here from the blog that I can talk to you guys about. Uh, I think there might be, like, a couple questions that they had. And you can see my – I'm also grinding for Gidry. That's why I have Nolan Ryan in. Um, the other uh, Battle Royale reward is that uh, Julio uh, Urias, uh, the Dodgers pitcher. Uh, the ticket counter guys will be Carson Kelly, Manuel Margot, Rafael Devers, Jeff Hoffman, uh, Sean Newcomb, and Josh Hader. The ranked season monument awards are Giolotto and Dansby Swanson. And then the postgame rewards and packs are Bregman, Martez, Gallo. Ozzie Abilas, uh, Orlando Arcia, Clint Frazier, Blake Snell, Bradley Zimmer, Bernardo uh, Lopez, Jorge Alfaro, Franklin Barreto, and uh, Hunter Renfro. If I said anybody's name wrong, man, I'm sorry, dude. Like, I'm I'm just doing the best I can to read those. Um, there's a Joey Gallo with a ton of power. And uh, also, uh, in the future starts packing, you can get that Ahmed Rosario or that Tyler Glass now. <clears throat> and so uh, let's go into a little bit of question and answer before we wrap up this video today the show mailbag how many packs can I redeem per day in the free pack missions you can redeem up to one standard pack per day through the free pack missions I've been doing that every day it's nice you get a free pack if I can't log in every day with those free pack missions be waiting for me to redeem the next time I play unfortunately you cannot redeem these limited time missions at a later date the missions expire after the 24-hour countdown runs out of pacific time midnight pacific time uh when is the next roster update that'll be august 25th uh will you make more future stars uh we will consider it and evaluate the newest mlb call-ups and what is the next event it is on tuesday look for more event details on monday so guys that's what i've been up to the last couple days is i've just been uh grinding for this joe mauer and i'm getting really close so i'm gonna try and finish that up today um if you'd be interested in seeing me stream that leave that down in the comments below because i haven't streamed in a while so uh it might be time to do that again what do you guys think about the new uh future stars what do you guys think about um the new mauer mission <clears throat> and uh i hope you guys are having a great day thank you so much for watching movie gaming tv and i'll see you guys in the next video Peace out.